Hi, welcome to the Page Family Homestead. My name is Peggy, or Peggy Jean, Grandma, Grandma. Andy's behind us in the living room. He just got home. I'm really excited about this video because, well, we're making butter tarts. And it's my friend Judy Rose's recipe. And I hope her relations, Bruce and, what is it, Bruce and the twins. Name. Yeah, the twin. I, yeah. I I hope they don't see this, but maybe they should. Then they could make them and stop bugging Judy to make them for them all the time. But they're that good. Now they do have an ingredient that we have for the last few years avoided, except for maybe one or two times. But uh, corn syrup. If you're really opposed to corn syrup, don't use it. Use maple syrup. But your butter tarts will be a little runnier. This is Christmas. We're making this for Christmas and our Christmas cookie trays and for Andy and myself. So I'm going to follow her recipe because these are so good. So good. It's Christmas. It's a treat. We eat things we shouldn't. Um, the dough, I, I used my same recipe that I used for our turkey pot pie the other day. I'll put a link to that video here. But... I changed it. For meat, that's the recipe. For meat pies, that's the recipe I use. But when I'm using it for uh, pies, uh, like sweet pies, uh, fruit pies, I add a full cup of flour. Um, I did make a double recipe that is a single crust recipe, so I made two single crust recipes. I did do it all together, and it did work. I seem to remember someone telling me, don't, it won't work, but it did. Um, I rolled it up, put it in the fridge for overnight, and the pictures are self-explanatory. I will type right here, or is it over here, right here, the recipe for the pie crust. So right now, I'm going to bring you in. You won't see me. You'll be seeing what I'm doing. We're going to be making butter tarts. Right now, I've already got the crust made and the form in the forms and the tins. And they're in the fridge chilling while we do this. So let's get you to the stove. So for this recipe, just so you can have everything ready, and I will type it out. See here, I have it on our cell phone here. <laughs> Judy's butter tarts. We're going to use one half cup of brown sugar, one half cup of corn syrup or maple syrup, one egg lightly whipped, two tablespoons of butter. I've got two healthy tablespoons of butter. One teaspoon of vanilla. One teaspoon of white vinegar. If you don't want to use white vinegar, you can also use lemon juice. A pinch of salt, which I've already applied into the brown sugar. And a quarter cup of raisins and or coconut or any nut you want. Um, what I do with our raisins is while I'm making the the ingredients here all together, the sauce, the butter tart, I leave these to soak in warm water so that they're poofy. They're applied to the shell afterwards. So now we're going to go to the stove and build this wonderful butter tart. Okay, I just put the fire on. It's a nice thick bottom pot. I'm going to put in my butter going to get this melted and I'm going to melt that down with the brown sugar and my salt.
Okay, so I got these done. What I've done is I've drained the raisins and put them in six and then in three of them just a few because we're going to put some coconut in the remaining. I'll do that with you now. Some people like both, some people like one or the other. So I try to accommodate everybody. Just going to put a little spoonful of coconut in here. I like them with everything. It doesn't matter. I'm not putting nuts in it this time. So now what we do is we take this syrup that we made and we put it three quarters full. Hope I have a little extra or maybe enough. Maybe I'll just put a little bit to make sure I have enough. I could make more, but I got some more dough, so looks like I'll be making another batch regardless. These are so good, guys. Yeah, I'll be making another batch. You'll hear Andy in the background. <laughs> we got a smaller wood stove, more efficient than the one that was taking up our whole living room. So he's working on the piping on that. Okay, I'm going to make another batch of this sauce because I've got more dough, like I said. So it'll work out perfect. Okay, the oven is preheated to 400. I'm going to put them in for 10 minutes and then reset to 375 for another 10. Okay, the timer's gone off. It's been 10 minutes, so we are now going to put it to 375. course it's already there. Uh, timer, I'm going to put it on for eight minutes. Should be ten according to the recipe, but just watching my stove. Now I just want to make sure the crusts get done and yay, almost finished. So while I was doing that, I had a little bit of extra dough. I, I'm just making some little ones here, tiny, tiny little tarty ones. And I'll put those in when these ones come out. Oh, near catastrophe. I overfilled. Who's going to complain? We're just going to let these cool in their pan. Oh, no mess in the bottom of the oven. So it's a win-win. Mini ones are in. I'll bring you back when everything's cooled and ready to be moved. So here we go. There's one missing. I wonder where that went. Ooh, still no. I like the little ones too. Yeah. They turned out good. So, I already know how flaky it is. I took them out. Want to give it a sample, please? Could you please I give could, us a sample? Yes, I think I'll try it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what did you get, a raisin or a coconut? No, I just tried the, the what do you call it there? Hmm, very good. Flaky? Flaky, very flaky. Yeah. I know. Nice. Oh. Nice and light. Tastes like Judy's. Mm -hmm. Did I do it? You did it. I did it. Yay. <laughs> so I'll we'll just wait till they cool a little bit more mm -hmm. and we'll put them in the freezer. I'll make sure they're all good too. <laughs> <laughs> they're going deep freeze, man. Or they're all, I don't want to do more. <laughs> so <laughs> we're making lemon ones tomorrow, guys. Well, lemon ones, yes. <laughs> so if you like this, give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment below what you thought of it. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, please. And don't forget that notification bell. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> we'll see you next video. You just want to hurry this done so I can <laughs> hurry up and start the, the ones with lemon, eh? Mmm.